So does your fridge look like this after the Easter holiday? You know, it's filled with leftovers or maybe food you thought you would eat but didn't because you decided to eat out for lunch yesterday. You know, Americans waste 40%, 40% of our food supply. That amounts to about 80 billion pounds of food thrown away every year. Wow, that's a huge number. Chef Chris from the Beaver Street Commissary joins us now to walk us through some things that we can do to reduce what we waste. Good morning, thanks for being with us, appreciate it. Good morning, it. good morning, thanks for having me. So let's start maybe with meal prep. Is there something we can do so that we're not throwing away so much? Absolutely, absolutely. You can start with, uh, let's say you have just the family of two or family of four. Start by buying a whole chicken. Roast your chicken and then you have extra parts and pieces of your vegetables, just set those aside. Roast your chicken. After you've had dinner, you're gonna have some leftover chicken. Cut up that chicken. It'll last for three days in your refrigerator. Cut it up, use it for tacos, slice it, put it on a frozen pizza for your kids, put it on top, put that in the oven, boom, you now have a chicken pizza. Yeah, it, um, it's interesting that you bring that up because my kids swear that I make chicken way too often because I'm looking for something healthy for them, you know? And so getting creative, I think, is another important part of that so that it doesn't feel like you're feeding them the same food over and over exactly, again. Exactly, exactly. You can, you can use this in um, chicken enchiladas. You can make chicken tacos, saute it with some onions, throw some cumin in there. You've got some great chicken meals out of one thing. And this is 99 cents a pound. Wow. Yeah. Whole chicken. So you chickens. can save money. A yeah. lot of money. You can save a lot of money and save a lot of waste. And that's the biggest thing. We're, you know, this is the inaugural week. It's the first time they've ever done this event in Florida. And it's about cutting back on your waste. Sustainability event that's yes. coming up, which I'll tell everybody about yes. here in just a minute. So what about composting? Composting can seem a little overwhelming. It can seem overwhelming, but we have a product that's called Bokashi, and it's a fermented product. And thankfully, um, it comes from the outer shells of coffee beans. Hmm. So Martin Coffee locally provides me with all of the outer shell that I need. We make Bokashi. You add this to your countertop container. So you make it as convenient as you can. So all of your vegetable waste can stay on your counter for the week and then put it into your compost. So then and what you've done here on the left, for example, this is your extra here. So it is. you would then at the end of your meal prep, you, you would add it in then with, with this that you get from Bokashi. Yep. Yeah, Bokashi. And we make that and sell it at Standard Feed and Seed. So it's all, everything about this is local. So you can take this and take the carcass from the chicken, reduce all this down in water, and now you've got chicken stock. Keep it in your freezer. You've, or if you do not eat meat, vegetable stock. It doesn't matter. So vegetable stock replaces water in all of your cooking. So utilize as much as you can. And then people say, yeah, but you've got rotten vegetables on your kitchen counter, but it doesn't smell. It doesn't. It does not smell. And so you don't have to worry about bugs or- You don't have to worry about anything. Or something Put that in your compost at the end of the week, let it break down. And the water that comes from the breakdown goes into your plants and it's super powerful water. It's like miracle Grow on Steroids. There you go. <laughs> right? Okay. So, so for people who uh, they they want to get started, I, you yes. know, I've always wanted to compost. My mom's really good about this, but it is, it, it you, you know, we 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 seem like we're so busy, and I'm making up really bad excuses. You know, is there some place we can learn more about it, where we can purchase this, you know, in, so that yes. we can start doing it, you know, as yes. our family? There are several different ways. Well, first, you can start by your catering companies and your in your companies. Bring your catering companies in that use compostable items. At 927 Events, we try to use all compostable items at all times. So this is a bamboo spoon. Oh, wow. So that's not going into it's our just waste. It's like and, anything else. Sure, yeah. right. It's then, sturdy too, it's not gonna fall apart, yeah. And then tomorrow there's an all day event with different chefs all over the state of Florida. 
you can go to the website and um, you can, you, you know, they'll list that at the bottom of the screen. I'm sure it'll be on your website. Yep. yep. But um, it will be all day showing you how to utilize as much as you can out of each product. And it'll be chefs lined up on Zoom all day long. Chef Chris, thank you. Great information. And again, we have posted a link so that you can attend this virtual sustainability event on our website, newsforjax.com. Thank Fantastic you. Fantastic ideas. Appreciate it. We'll be right back.